Hey, what's going on YouTube? So it was best here. Here about to show you how to upgrade the RAM in the 27 inch iMac. It's the same similar process to the 21.5 inch iMac as well. So I'm gonna be bumping this baby all the way up to 12 gigs. So we're gonna jump right into it. All right, now the first, the two things you're gonna need is you'll need your additional RAM, your additional memory. And I got mine from MacSales.com, or better known as OWC. And uh, it's about $320 for two four gig sticks. Now you can get two gigabyte sticks for cheaper, but I got two four gig sticks since the 27 inch iMac only has four slots. And also you're gonna need a screwdriver as well. All right, now at this point, you wanna flip the iMac onto a screen. I make sure whatever surface you're working on is pretty protective. Put some type of cover, sheet, or something on there to protect the screen from getting any scratches at this point. Now you wanna go ahead and take your screwdriver and start unscrewing the, uh, the bottom panel there. It's directly in the middle once you flip it on to a side, directly in the middle on the bottom of the screen. And it's three little screws there, very easy to screw off. And then after you do that, the little sling screen here will flip over. All right, now what you want to do is go ahead and get some two little black tabs there. You just want to pull those tabs out, these little plastic tabs. Like so. All right, so now the black tabs, what they're there for is actually, actually pull them out and give them a nice little tug. Don't be afraid. Give them a nice little tug, and they'll go ahead and unseat the RAM, and then now you can easily pull the RAM out of its socket. All right, so that's how you take the RAM outside of the 27-inch iMac. So I'm going to put these two RAM modules back inside the iMac. Now, from the tutorials that I watch, everybody put the original uh, RAM in the top two slots there. So I'm just going to follow suit. I don't know if there's a particular reason why you're doing that, to be honest with you, but I'm just going to do the same thing I saw. And, go ahead and, and you see here, I am pressing it in nice and tight there. It does take a little bit of snug to get them right seated in there correctly. All right, so go ahead and take your new RAM out that you're going to be installing. And you see here, right the tip, the little gold-plated tips here, now, the short end is on the right-hand side, so that's how you want to push it into your iMac. Don't flip it around. Make sure the short side of the, the little gold tips are actually on the right-hand side. So you want to go ahead and place this in here. Again, you're going to have to give it a little bit of tug there, a little bit of force to get it seated in there. And then once you know, um, to know that you got, it, you got it seated, you hit a little snap, a little pop there. Okay, so now you want to go ahead and tuck these two black tabs that you pulled out in the beginning. You want to tuck them right back in in between the RAM modules themselves. All right, so actually get those two black tabs tucked back in. We're gonna go ahead and take the little plate that you unscrewed off. We're gonna go ahead and just place it right back in. It should hold by itself for a little bit. Then we're gonna go ahead and screw the three screws right back in there. And the screws will stay with the plate, so you don't have to worry about losing the screws. Okay, so in order to see that you got everything installed correctly, well, of course, you got to boot up your computer. Now, at this point, once you're booting up your computer, if you hear like any beeping noises, anything like that, that means your RAM is not in there correctly. So you need to go back and recheck your RAM. But all right, once you get everything booted up, I'm going to make sure everything is installed correctly. Go to About This Mac and to your Mac right here to hit the Apple button. And you should see all the additional RAM that you actually installed there. So now you see I've got 12 gigabytes in my baby here. All right, it's been Sony Knows Best. Here. Very simple, easy way to install RAM into your iMac here. And a very simple process, just as simple as you do on the MacBook Pro. So if you have any questions, just feel free to shout a comment below. Either me or somebody else will probably be able to answer it for you. But thanks for watching. I'll catch you later. Peace.